In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to use the Artwork Uploader to customize your envelopes. In the Artwork Uploader, you can upload image files and add text to your envelopes. When uploading your artwork, there are three preferred formats, PDF, Adobe Illustrator EPS, and Adobe Photoshop EPS. If you don't have one of these formats, you may also use a JPEG, TIFF, PNG, or GIF file. In this example, I'm going to upload a PDF. Note, if you experience any issues with your file not uploading, you can always call us, chat with us, or email us for assistance. Once your image has uploaded, you can now move it around on the envelope, resize it, and tilt it so that you get the exact look and feel you would like. You'll notice that around your image is a box. On the edges and corners of that box are other small boxes. These small boxes are points that you can click and drag to resize the artwork. At the very top is another box that is separated from the rest by a line that will allow you to turn the logo if you wish to have a different orientation, such as a vertical orientation or an angled orientation. In this case, we're going to leave the logo in a horizontal orientation. However, our logo is a little too large, so let's shrink it down by clicking one of the corners and dragging it to the size we would like. You can also click the middle of the image and drag it to the location you would like. If your image looks a little bit pixelated or low quality, don't worry about that. Currently in the preview, we are using a low resolution version of the image to make it easier to work with while you're setting up your envelopes. We will email a high resolution PDF proof for all new orders. We will not print your order without your approval. We will also contact you prior to sending the proof if there are any issues with your art file. Once your logo is placed in the location you would like, you still have the option of adding text. In this case, I'm going to add our street address in the text box, which will appear in the top left of the envelope. Since we've placed our logo at the top left, they're overlapping, but we can move that text box by clicking and dragging it below the logo. If you need to edit your text, you can always go back into the text box and make changes. Here, you can also select a different font, different font size, and even color from those available. Once your artwork and text are as you would like them on the front, you can move on to customize the back. In this case, we're going to leave the back blank. Once you're finished, you can then go down and leave any additional instructions you wish to pass along to the printer before placing your order. This box is limited to 500 characters, so please keep the instructions concise. Once you've finished, Click the Proceed to Checkout button where you will see a small preview of the envelope you have created and where you can complete your order.